Jackson Elementary closed back in 2015 and tonight the Bedford County Board of Supervisors voted to sell a piece of the property in hopes of bringing more revenue to the community. 10 News reporter Irisha Jones is back from Bedford with more on the decision. Irisha. Well, Lindsay, supervisor says the building has been sitting vacant for several years and during that time there was vandalism at the property and now they believe is a good time to sell while there is still a decent offer on the table. In a five to one vote, supervisors decided to sell only a portion of the vacant Thaxton Elementary School for $150,000. A steel fabrication company out of Lynchburg will be using the space to expand their operations. Supervisors say they've wanted to do something with the property for a long time and now is the opportunity to have a benefit for economic development. But not all residents are excited about the sale. Well, the positive thing is we put a business back in. We get a building occupied that's sitting there and it's doing nothing right now. And it's a good business. I think it'll be good for the community. They got a chance to grow up to 14 employees, and they got to do some work that's still going to improve the, the property as well. The proposed use for the property is inappropriate for what I'd consider downtown Thaxton or Second and Main Thaxton. Secondly, I think that the amount of money that the county is going to get for the, that piece of property is not sufficient. Supervisors also approved a trash collection site on the east side of the school property. The county says they looked at other options for the property, but, but thought this was the best company to move in. In the studio, Arisha Jones, 10 News, working for you.